Hello and welcome to another My Interesting Pictures video and today I will explain you the No Means No case in 60 seconds. So let's start this 60 seconds now. Imagine somebody tries to rape you or is already raping you and you tell that person no, I don't want that. Imagine you don't or you're just not able to defend yourself actively or fight that person by for example beating that person. Now imagine that simply saying no is not enough to successfully sue that person in court. In fact, it's the other way around. You are getting sued because you made a false statement. That was the legal situation in Germany until now. For years now, political parties in Germany fought for a change in law that simply saying no or stop it is enough to actually sue your rapist. But only now, things are changing. Why? Two things brought more awareness to the problem. First, the sexual assault in Cologne a couple of months ago. Second, the Gina Lisa case. A German celebrity who got supposedly raped by two men recorded on video, she screams stop it but got sued for making a false statement. But now the German parliament approved a new law. In future it is enough to call it a rape when the victim is only saying no or stop it and in future it is a crime when somebody grabs and touches you in a sexual way. So no means no. Well, I hope I made it in time, I hope I made it within the 60 seconds because, gosh, even with the editing, it was so difficult, it was so difficult. So I hope I enjoyed the video, no, I hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs> I did actually enjoy the video. And if you want to see more videos like this, uh, explaining something very quickly within 60 seconds, please leave it in the comments below, your opinion and your recommendations and everything. And yeah, that was it. Thank you very much for watching and as always, stay interested to be my interesting. Goodbye.